Because Southern Colorado braces for another round of heat, meteorologist Casey Dorn is diving into the forecast in Paris for the games. Will the U.S. reign in the rain? During the last Summer Olympics in Tokyo, the big story was heat. Paris is no stranger to summer heat waves. On this date historically, Paris has seen triple digit highs. This weekend though, our athletes will need a rain jacket. Rain this evening in Paris, along with cooler than average temperatures, are starting off the games as a large low swirls north of France, dragging a cold front with it. Periods of rain will be possible into Saturday afternoon, although I expect the best heavy rain potential to be east by then. Saturday will also be one of the coolest days in the last several Olympics, with highs only in the 60s. Hopefully our athletes can tap into high pressure for some high scores as it returns for Sunday's events, resulting in clearing skies as well. Now high pressure continues to dominate the first week of the games, resulting in warm temps. It won't be enough to prevent showers and clouds from putting up a good showing. A weak system is likely to bring isolated showers by late Tuesday and through the middle of the week. By next weekend, the high will retreat as a top ranked low approaches from the Atlantic. As this low meanders during the first full week of August, unsettled conditions return with clouds, showers and below average temperatures. Now on the seven day forecast, while the springs sits in the 90s, France warms to the 80s. Southern Colorado and France both feel the heat on Tuesday, but that's where the similarities will end. Paris cools and we stay hot late next week. Now, while Paris isn't going to be feeling the sustained heat in the next couple of weeks, hopefully the cooler temps allow Team USA to bring the heat themselves. Meteorologist Casey Dorn, News 5.